congratulations on the film. Thank you very much. This isn't just, you know, the story of the great man. This is, I think, the story of a great woman just standing behind the great man in a lot of ways. Tell me a little bit about Jane Hawking and uh, what your take on her was, because for me, the movie is just as much about her as it is about him. Uh, absolutely. Well, it's it's often the case with very famous and rich people that there's someone in the background doing all the very unglamorous yeah. work. <laughs> That's right. And um, and and it was about bringing Jane, you know, to light. She's a fascinating woman in her own right, and. I met her and actually very intimidated. Mm -hmm. I, I was so, what I just mean, tremendous force of character and strength to, to, to do what she did. Mm -hmm. And it's not easy being the carer in that situation, particularly for, for, for someone who's very famous, I think you can feel a, a little bit eclipsed. And so all, for all of us, it was about sort of bringing, bringing Jane's story to, to light. And do you feel, you say you met her, uh, the, the story is based on one of her books, did you feel a real responsibility towards her, or is what's written on the page what's written on the page, and that's the story you'll tell without much regard for her? No, I think it's always, I think always with Jane, because of her book as well, there's so, so much richness mm -hmm. in her life that it would have been stupid for me to not, to not uh, have her as, as my, my resource. Right. And it was about capturing her essence. The essence of this woman is is someone who is very, very strong-willed, who is um, persistent and, and you know, is a, was an academic in her own right, an incredibly intelligent woman. And so it's taking that and also bringing your instinct and, 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 um, and bringing a, 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 making that person as sort of um, inhabiting them as much as possible. Did she give you hints? Did she give you ideas? A lot of what you do and the way that you interact with your husband, Stephen Hawking, in the film, particularly as the story moves along and he's becoming more and more wheelchair bound, is very specific in the way that you have to um, help him move his head to help, you know, do any sort of thing. Did she give you, a, like, an insider's peek at what that would be like? Uh, she actually, when I went to visit Jane, we sat down and lo looked at pictures that she had old slides of her and Stephen when they first met. And it was mo it was just looking at those, and there were things of, of Jane, you know, when they would go on boating holidays, yeah. and, and just seeing the dynamic between them. So Stephen at that point wasn't able to, to move, so Jane would be steering the boat. Mm -hmm. And I sort of, in a way, you absorb, a, you want to absorb as much as possible from, from what she was showing me. And also, when I met her, you know, sometimes I felt a little bit disingenuous because we'd be talking, but I'd just be observing things right. about her. Right. You're, you're trying, it's a bit like being a detective. You're trying to find clues about who this character, who this I'm character is. I'm stealing your soul. Yeah, slowly. exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah. And what is her reaction? Um, she's very pleased with the film. Yeah, yeah. she's yeah. been very supportive all the way through, and and um, and so and, and for her, it was so important that Stephen had that he, she had his blessing right. to to have the film made, as it was you know based on her book. And when he gave that, she it meant a huge amount to her. And that must be very gratifying for you. Yeah, absolutely. Well, you don't want the person to watch it and then say, God, that's not, that's awful. <laughs> that wasn't right at all, you know. So For it's, posterity. Yeah. She's taken my life. I, 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 absolutely. You know, you, you want to care for the person that you're playing and show that in your performance. What do you hope people take away from it? And I ask that because it's a beautiful love story, but it's also a story about uh, never saying, never giving up. It's a story about... Uh, you know, expanding your mind. So, boy, there's a lot of you know elements that make up the the whole story. What do you hope people walk away? What's most important to you about this story? I think it's actually when I was watching it last night, it was that I thought it's about it's not just about Jane and Stephen. It's about hu being human, right. and and somehow um, you you sort of watch it and you feel like, oh, why do we why do we fight each other? Why is there so much pain and and conflict and you sort of go we're so lucky to even be here you know and and that sounds sort of like they sound like very grand <laughs> thoughts to be having but i really think the film does does provoke that it stops you thinking with your ego for a bit i think and just it's about loving each other <laughs> what's a lovely movie thank you very much thank you thank you thanks